Greetings, Ascending Nation. So I'm coming to you with a message. If you're new, welcome. If you're not new, welcome. Make sure you like, share, comment, and subscribe to energetically support the channel. Okay? So let's go ahead and get started. So um, the messages that come through today are from Big Pun. Okay, if you're not familiar with him, I will leave a link in the description. All right, so um, what led me to doing these messages, I have a deck that I use and um, well, I have several decks that I made. One of them in particular, I shuffled and the heaven card came out of that deck. Um, I then was called to pick up my celebrity deck and I did so and all of these individuals came out. OK, so it made me want to, you know, start or do these videos. I already know that it, that this is one of my calling. So why not do it? So um, if I'm called to do it, so we're going to get started. Um, so these messages are in reference to big pun. This could have something to do with what happened with to him. OK, or it could be something, you know, that's going on past, present and future. All right. So the first uh, word or card that came out was stolen money. OK. Right behind that, we have pain. OK, P-A-I-N. So I feel like uh, the energy I picked up immediately was that he was hurt, um, <clears throat> hurt. Uh, to know or to see, you know, that uh, valuables, I'm picking up valuables as well, and money was stolen from him, okay? We have conflict spells, okay? So something significant about conflict spells, all right? We have natural causes in reverse. So we do know that it was somewhat put out there that, you know, he transitioned, if I'm not mistaken, it was due to his weight, okay? Um... Following that, we have he's guilty, earth sign, okay? And I did clarify, okay, um, we have Taurus and we have Virgo that both came out, okay? So this individual could be, you know, Taurus, um, sun, moon, or rising, or Virgo, sun, moon, or rising, okay? I actually did see someone whom was close to him that was a Taurus, okay? Um, next we have whistleblower. All right. We have peace. So I do strongly feel like that he is at peace. Okay. Um, I just feel like that, you know, he, it upset him to see that, uh, there were, you know, some thieves around him. Okay. Um, next we have food or drink poisoning. So I don't know if this resulted to his demise. Okay, but it definitely came out. I have something here about a nursing home abuse. Okay, so I don't know if I don't know if he uh, received any um, care outside of being in the hospital or not. Okay, um, I don't know if he was ever in a nursing home. I don't know if anyone connected to him was in a nursing home. Okay, and then we have woman in reverse. Okay, so the energy I picked up, um, I did shuffle. And we have the Aquarius and the Libra that came out, okay? And whomever this woman is, um, she is known, okay? Because it came out in reverse. Um, this person could be an Aquarius, sun, moon, or a rising, or a Libra, sun, moon, or rising, okay? Next, we have death, okay? So the death card came out. The number 79 could be significant. July 9th could be significant. September 7th could be significant as well, okay, I'm not sure of the actual date, that big pun transition, or, you know, when he was born, okay, the year 1979 could be significant as well, okay, um, so we have endless harm inevitable, okay, so I do feel like, I don't know if he was expecting this, okay, that's the energy I'm getting from this, this, you know, from this car coming out, okay, uh, then we have Sweet Dream 39, okay, and it says Satisfaction, Comfortable, Lazy Day. Uh, the month March 9th could be significant or September 3rd, okay. Uh, and with these two cards together, I just picked up peace again, okay, that he's definitely at peace, all right. So that is everything that I have. 
um, the messages from Big Pun Gratitude. And I appreciate you all for tuning in as well. And I'll talk to you in the next video.